What's wrong with you people? Jesus Christ. Am I the only one? I had a dream the other night. I was floating up to heaven on a pool of blood, the people drowning in their own blood, gurgling. And they were trying to get on top of me to use me as a flotation device. Get off me, asshole. I'm just floating up to the maker on a pool of blood. And that's exactly what's going to happen. Just like I said in February 2020, it was fucking over. And there's five things that have happened to me that I thank God. Sally won three kids and Corona fucking motherfucking Corona are the five best things that have ever happened to me, ever. And if you don't take advantage of this, you deserve to be in that pool of blood that I float up the fucking Valhalla on. And then unless you think of it that graphically, you will fail. And I can go on and on and on and on. And you guys that come to this seminar are just the fucking antithesis of that. These people talk shit. Fuck! Are you fucking shitting me? This is it. What are you gonna tell your grandkids 20, 30, 40 years from now? What did you do, Grandpa, during the greatest dislocation of wealth on the fucking planet, other than sit with your thumb up your fucking ass? This is the greatest dislocation of wealth in the 13.8 billion years that the planet's been here. And what the fuck have you done? Nothing. Or more importantly, what the fuck are you gonna do? In bumfuck Alabama, you can live on $41,000 a year. In some place of hunger, you can make a live on 30 grand a year. Are you kidding me? Fuck, I'm gonna get an aneurysm myself, I'm gonna scream so loud. I mean, forget about it. I mean, what are you smoking? How is this possible that you're so distended from wealth? How is it possible? You're so fucking stupid. How? All of you should have rolled down the inside of your mama's leg. You will never ever exceed your most wild expectations. The world is engaged in self-sabotaging activity and they can't help themselves. You don't wanna know the fucking truth. It's an awful thing to say, but I, South Africa was better off with apartheid. Now, I'm one of the few people that I would say that. When we'll, I th I'm the only guy in America that said it was a good thing he slapped him. If I slapped a little cocksucker, he'd be in the hospital. Because that's how I was raised. You fuck with my woman, you're a dead man. The guy is 6'2", 225, and the little shit's 135, and he can't even knock him on the ground. And Smith is supposed to be a tough actor. Fuck. And that's why it's so easy for us. Now see, that's the difference between me and you. Forget that I got the money to do it. I got sex, I can't hardly walk. They're so fucking big. You wanna de-risk your decision before you make it. And the reason why the banks are in love with our model, literally, they wanna have our babies, is when we bring them a project and we're using commercial debt, and this is really important, the concept, it's already de-risked. It's already deleveraged up. Because when it's easier to buy revenue than create it. And when you buy a million dollars, a million euros, a million pounds in revenue, you don't know how much m money the fucking moron spent to create that million, do you? It's a no fucking brainer. Everybody understands that. 97% of the S&P 500 and all the indices, the companies have grown from acquisition, not organic growth. Organic growth is for losers. How did he do it? How's that possible? Unpolished pig fucker that he is. Because he wanted the money more than he wanted air to breathe. That's why. And most people that come through this fucking program don't. And that's why you continue to go to seminars, you continue to read books. These guys that tell you you can read two books a day, it's such a fucking lie. But you listen to their podcasts, you buy their shit. It's such a fucking lie. Even if you don't believe it, you can listen to it. Where else can minus intellect, meatheads that I affectionately call you, can't chew gum and wipe your ass at the same time, get fucking rich? Where else? What model? can be used for people that can't brush their teeth and wipe their ass at the same time. QLA. Other than that, I wish you not all the luck, but the perseverance to go out and fucking rip their head up and shit down their neck. God bless. Hey. Okay, YouTube. Bye-bye. We don't want to give you too many secrets.